when Stephanie and Blake Shelton makes fans day with the latest announcement. The celebrity couple met on The Voice in 2014 and began dating the following year. When Stephanie and Blake Shelton have made the most of every second together over the past few months during the coronavirus pandemic. During this time, the celebrity couple released their second duet, Happy Anywhere, and created a music video during lockdown at Blake's Rand in Oklahoma. The single has been a big hit with fans of the couple, and on Tuesday, Blake revealed that they could be performing it live on ACM Awards later in the month. Taking into Instagram to share footage of himself and Wen singing outside on the ranch, Blake wrote, Happy Anywhere with Wen Stephanie is coming to you all live from the ACM Awards. Get ready and tune it into CBST on September 16th at 87C to watch. Fans were quick to react to the news with one writing. Whoa, I love good news. While well, another wrote, Can't wait. Been listening to Blake all day long. Love you both. A third added, I love you two together. Many years of happiness to you. And when you finally put a ring on it, Blake. When and Blake met on the set of The Voice in 2014 and began dating the following year. Wen was previously married to Bush frontman Gavin Rosdale, and the former couple shared three sons, Kingston, Zuma, and Abelo, who also have a close relationship with Blake. During a previous appearance on Today's Show, Wen opened up about just how much Blake helps out with her sons while chatting to host Hoda Kelby. When asked if she thought he could make a good father, she replied, He's a good dad. Actually, he's been helping me out a lot. So I literally get to the point where I'm like, you gotta get home. I need help. So it's hard. I got three boys. In July, meanwhile, the country singer admitted that he was having a blast during quarantine with Wen. While taking, talking on Sirius XM's The Storm Warren show on the Highway Channel, he said, Obviously, none of us like these circumstances, but I could be lying if I say that I'm not having a blast being stuck at home for this long because I've been never gotten to do it before, you know, since I've owned a home, I've never been able to be there more than two weeks max at a time.